Hi! <laughs> these, these, uh, these intros are never gonna get good, I swear. Recently, I purchased uh, the felt nibs for the PW517 pin. I don't know what the numbers are, I'm sorry. I haven't actually used it yet, and I feel bad that I haven't. The nibs themselves came in this, this little bag right here. Uh, let's see if there's like a, a serial number for it. Model PN05F. And, oh, I forgot to mention that there's like 10 of them. And I, I, I put it on here, and I haven't... Let's see if I can get it on camera, probably won't. There he be. Look at, look at the nib. He's small. Yeah, I did put it on there, and I tried it out a bit, but I didn't... I haven't actually drawn with it yet, so I want to try that out. I've only been, I've been using the thing for about a month as it is, and I mean, I've done a bit of uh, Inktober, which I'm, I'm planning to maybe, uh, do like a compilation of all the, the shitty Inktober drawings I did for the past, for the first nine days, until I was like, ah, I, it's too much, I can't keep drawing, like, continuously for 30 days. That was the plan, but that would have been also a chonky compilation to make with all the speed draws to compile and shit. I mean, I got nine days in, and I, I did pretty well, I guess. So, when I drew on the Canvas 16, ugh, I should have not cut my nails before this, because it's really hard to get this this top shell off. Thank you! Ah! So, I'm just gonna put a picture up of, of this, just for reference, but I put all of the felt nibs inside of the pin holder, uh, with one plastic nib, just for comparison, and then I've got the other plastic nibs wrapped up in this this tiny, teeny little plastic bag. Oh yeah, also I got a ruler. <laughs> this thing's so fucking fun to use. And the lines that I get with it are great. I don't like using the Clip Studio, like line tool. I'd rather have something physical that I don't have to like, uh, uh, okay, that's good, erase that after I'm done with that layer. Alright! Onto the drawing portion. Ugh. Never mind. <laughs> I decided to move everything over here because it's just easier. And now that I can just move my drawing system on my lap somewhere else, it's so much fucking easier. Okay. This is a uh, regular nib. I feel like I should draw like fast strokes and slow strokes to see if there's a comparison. I can't really draw slow strokes because my wrist is really weird and I haven't really practiced like drawing like deliberate lines because even this is like too much of a stretch. I'm more of like a like just scribble and pray so. <laughs> here's here's plastic nib man. I'm gonna go ahead and pull out this nib too. Okay now this is gonna be Felt nib, man, I guess. <laughs> oh, right, I forgot. Okay, so deliberate strokes. I, I, I should have done that with a plastic nib first. <laughs> What's a good deliberate stroke? I'm not really sure because I don't, again, I don't draw deliberate strokes really. It's just draw fast and hope that it looks good. I really need to work on my, my wrist control. I noticed that, like, there's. There's always sort of like a squareness to my, to my, to like any round stuff that I make. Cause I mean, these, these are all like pretty like, they're meant to be like sort of cute circles. Still working on hair too, honestly. I mean, I drew something pretty recently that I feel like worked pretty well. It's for a friend. I, I did a lot of experimental stuff and it, it turned out really well. I'm also going to have that on here. Boom! There it is. I hope you guys like it. It looks, I, I'm pretty proud of it. Yeah! Okay. I am starting to notice it now. When you're drawing like slow strokes, it's, you really feel the grit, I feel like. Well, the plastic one, if you're trying to do that, it's like, whoop, like it just, it slips right under it, and it's, yeah, okay, I'm bored with that. I'm, I like it. Maybe I just have to use it for a while to really have like a, an idea of it, I guess. But that, I like that. That feels really good. This works. I like this. These nibs are are honestly, at least in my opinion, I feel like they're worth a purchase. If you are actually planning to get these, I advise getting them from AliExpress. Yeah, it'll take like three weeks to get here, but it's like, it's a very cheap product. Or like, it's not, it's inexpensive. There's not any point for you to have to pay like six to seven bucks for shipping wherever it's going. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> Again, these, these intros and outros are going to be really wonky for the first couple. I'm actually planning on doing a, like, a, a nostalgia review of my uh, HS611 at some point. 
but yeah, I'll I'll figure that out once I get when I get around to that video. Yeah, that was a review of the of the felt pen nibs that are really good. Honestly, go go check them out, please. I'll probably have like a link in the in, in the description. <laughs> See ya.